Hi, and welcome to Azure Perfu Quick Start number four. Today's topic is Perfu Studio, the development environment, the user interface to your Perfu account. I'm Wolfgang, and let's dive into the Perfu account details. In the last episode, we've created a new Perfu account. And whenever you open that Perfu account in your Azure portal, well, it's not that kind of interesting. There are no signs of creating data artifacts, scanning or whatever. It's just the user interface of Azure. The open Perfu Studio button, well, that's the thing you have to open and you have to use to open the Perfu Studio. Perfu Studio, which you can see here, is the main user interface to your Perfu account. What you see in the middle of the screen, well, those are the four main buttons similar user interface to Synapse Analytics, to Azure Data Factory. Uh, to start with, well, it's the Knowledge Center. Knowledge Center provides you with long links to documentation, videos, blogs, and so on and so forth. Second, well, register sources. We have to connect to the outside. That is the button and the action where we start to create connections to the outside. The Browse Asset functionality provides us with an ability to dive into the assets that were uh, created by scans. We will have a look at all those menu entries in one of the following videos. And the last but not least, it's the Manage Glossary button, which allows us as a Perfu data steward, as a Perfu uh, user, to create and manage a business glossary. What else is there in the user interface? Well, we've got the recently accessed assets. So all those assets I've had a look at in the last days, in the last month, whatever. And there's one thing I would like to highlight. If you watch this video before September 28th of 2021, well, there's the announcement for the Azure Perfu digital event. Register, it's for free. It will be fun and very interesting. What else is there? Well, we've got the main menu on the left side. We've got the data catalog to dive in, which actually leads and brings us back to the start screen. The data map, that's the thing where we can have a closer look at the data sources, the, the grouping of our data sources. Glossary, business glossary. The insights, it's the, the reporting about our Perfu account, what is there, how many scans, how many file types, what different kinds of file types, and the management section. It's everything there we need to know and we need to create and manage about the Perfu account. And there's one thing I want to mention. It's the search button. And that is the thing I I'm sure you will use at most whenever dealing with the Perfu data catalog is the search catalog search button. Search catalog search button. Sorry, it's the text box for the search keyword. And you know, if you search for uh, a keyword, well, that is the main entry. That is the, the user uh, guidance to get to the specific asset as you can see, to a SQL table, a Power BI data flow, a Power BI data set, a report, whatever. So main search, it's the one of the most important ones. Back to the data catalog. And with that, just a very, very quick start about Azure Perfu Studio. We will have a closer look at all those menu entries in the next videos. Stay tuned. If you liked it, just give me a, a hands up. If you don't like it, well, just comment what you didn't like. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned.